<laughs> all right welcome back to the channel um i don't really know how this is gonna go but this is just a review of all my minifigures well my ninjago ninja minifigures that is um so yeah i kind of lined these up i was doing it for a tiktok video and i just realized why not just review it because i couldn't fit everything i wanted to in that video so these are actually just most of them of the ninja I do have like sets like the Seabound one, this one right here, um, that I did want to, I was going to build this and I just never got to it and I just laid these out all tonight. So yeah, one, one last thing I wanted to mention at the time of this recording, it is show on the February 26th I believe, so this set is out and it's like an Evo set and it has like most of them. And I do want to get this. It's out of stock. Well, it's in stock at like Amazon, but it's 99 bucks. And I'm trying to save money and save room. So I don't really know. I want to get this, but I don't know how that will go. And I also wanted to get this set. They look dope. And I'm just a fan of mechs. And this is kind of like Ultron. Or well, not, uh, Voltron. Where it like detaches. And those are really big killers to a bank account. Though. And I am looking to save for the Star Wars. But yeah. I just wanted to throw that in there. All right, so let's get started. These are the original Ninja, the four original Ninja. Now, as far as these go for 2011, I think these are really solid. They don't have back printing, um, but they do have that little clip, and I do appreciate that. And I think these are pretty solid start. And I don't want it. They're not. They're not like the other ones, just because they're so plain and simple. But I appreciate that. The J is really faded. I did have a lot of Kai's, Cole, Zane, and I just put Lloyd there because I didn't really know where to put him. This is the original black robe. Um, yeah, I just wanted to show that he was from a spinner. And yeah, so as I move on, these are the DX. Um, I only have the Kai, the Cole, and I do have the Zane torso. Now it would probably be just an easy fix to um, change out the head and the hood but I just never got around to it. But I think I really like the gold part, and as a kid, I I couldn't fully really appreciate that, and it does have their names on the back, and I did as a kid appreciate that. And yeah, I this is my homemade Lloyd Garmadon. I kind of ruined the Zane torso, but when I didn't know who the Green Ninja was, I decided I wouldn't wait for Lego, and you know, just make my own. So these are the ZX suits. Now I have a very controversial opinion when it comes to these because these have to be one of my least favorite suits. Now I know how they're the classic OG Ninjago suits, but they just, they're not, I just don't like them. You know, compared to some other ones like um, the season 11 ones, even though I only have two, how they are different and unique from each other, but they just somehow, even with like the, the shoulder thing, and just they've come out even though they're individual they still somehow come together and that was one of my biggest gripes with the season seven one but these ones just don't do it for me now i will admit i do like this although the arm and that don't really um match together but they do fix it in the um day of the departure but i also do have the energy coal and energy oh, whoops energy zane and my lloyd he is kind of like ruined because i used to play with him a lot and i did have another one but I lost him. Um, there's Samurai X or Nia, and there is Wu. Somehow his legs aren't, they're not broken, but they're just like weak. Like he'll just fall down like that, and I don't know what that's about. Um, here are the Kimono Ninjas. I don't know if they have an official name other than that, but yeah, I have Kai, J, Cole, Zane, and Lloyd, and Golden Lloyd. Now, I like these a lot, just because this is like one of the first where they have like all black, and then they have their individual color. And although they don't have the shoulder pauldron, which I think it should have, um, just because in the show they do, and I think, like, Cole, it looks a lot better if they do. I don't mind it, because you can just easily pull one off him and just throw it on there, like I did there. But yeah, I really like how these, even with their ZX, these two are silver, and then Zane and Kai are gold. These are the rebooted suits. Now, initially, people did not like these just because they had the plain legs and the masks. 
Um, I I love these because you can have their hair and you can pull it off and put it on any of these past ones. I do only have in the regular rebooted. I only have Kai, and um, I do have Cole, and Zane, and Lloyd. Um, now I have the um the dragon. I meant the stone armor for um Kai and Jay. I don't have the regular Jay. But I really love these ones. And I don't know what it is about them. Maybe it's they also have leg printing. But and the the um half mask with the shoulder pauldrons. But I really love those too. And I also have Nia back here, which this is kind of like a I forgot where I got her. It might have been from a book or from like the cube thing. But I really like this because her gold is just awesome. So as we move on, we have the Tournament of Elements, which I think these are really interesting because it, um, each set, like, you could get two, because they had their tournament, and their, I think it was called Zukin, um, and they're, like, their jungle look, and their tournament look, and I appreciate, I really like how they did, like, two, two types, which it will kind of get brought back, I guess, in, um, season 12, but I really like how you could have both either or and i have all of these i have both guys both jays both coles and both zanes now this was i think this was from um one of the cube things i forgot what they're called but this is kind of like the tournament zane with his heart and chest open and i really like that and especially with the head mold underneath it which is awesome and i do like the titanium zane and yeah, that's all I gotta say for that. And I got both Lloyd and Nia, and then Wu back here, which is from a book, I do believe. As we move on, we move to possession. Now, I only have technically one, which is Cole. I don't have a J or Kai. And none of these sets really, I don't think, intrigue me, even though now that I look back, they, they are pretty cool. Especially with J's, whatever, his car thing, because you could like trap ghosts. But basically, I have him from like the air jutsu thing. He doesn't really count, so I only have Cole. Oh wait, I do have Nia. She came from this season. Um, Skybound, yeah. But I forgot about her a lot, and then Wu. But, so I can't really judge these, but I do, You, I think you either love or hate that they're like black with the exception of this. And I did know, I know I did say I liked it on that, but there's just something that like all black that I don't know how I feel about it. Um, now I know if we move on and I have all of the skybound because I really did love the season. I think the sets, even though some people say they're trash, some of them, it was either a hit or miss for the sets. But I do, these are some of my favorite with their golden pauldron. And then just like the air jutsu symbol on each of them. And I think they're just are really good looking, especially together with the dual molded mask. And they don't have these two side, but they have the one. And I think these are really solid sets. So as we move on, the Day of the Departed or Legacy 2. And I like how they're kind of a mix of their ZX. Their ZX suit. Because he's got like that, the strap. And then that. And it's kind of a mix like that. And I really like these suits, especially with the new one, Dual Molded. Which will be used next season, but I'll get to that later. Um, Jay again, I like how they fixed his arm. That really grew on me. Cole was okay. There wasn't much about him, but this Cole, this Cole is awesome. He's probably one of my favorite Cole figures. So. Yeah, with his torso and his translucent, transparent arms. Zane, this one came in the tumbler, and then this one was from a poly bag, which I'm really glad I got that. Unfortunately, I do not have a Lloyd, which I really like this Lloyd. Um, you know, I don't have and we move on to the hands of time by dark ages there's literally one kai and there's no one else and i got this from a cheap set and i'm so glad i got this and i remember in the store debating whether or not to get this but i'm glad i did so i can say i have a set from every ninjago period it's in every ninjago season um at first i hated these suits and i think that was one of the contributing reasons why i didn't get any sets from it because it just looked like armor to me which now that I think about it, it was really cool and I really wish I had gotten more of these even though the, the sets were okay um this is the Ninjago movie now you either hate 
you, this, as a Ninjago fan, we don't really speak about this, but I do appreciate, like, I kind of, once, once you kind of accept the redesigns with the hoods and, like, their hair and just the redesigns of everyone, you can, it, you can, you, once you accept it, you'll let it, like, it will grow on you, and it, that's what happened with me. I initially hated all these, but I really did eventually end up liking what has to come. I have three Lloyds, that poly bag from the blind bag, and then from the blind bag. I really love this hair. I think that's an exclusive color, because it does come back later. I don't really like the Zane. I think it was cool now, like, giving Cole, like, the shirtless muscle look, because he's, like, the strongest. And now they continue to do that for pre past, for the next seasons. Um, I really like Jay's legs. Kai, he's okay, but I think the coolest have, so he has to go to or Lloyd or Nia which I don't think I have it, or I might <laughs> and another thing to mention is I forgot where I got this but I have this poly bag from the movie um I never opened it I don't know why but I think that's just a cool poly bag because it kind of shows you know like his shirt him and his hoodie's half open he has this thing like Superman <laughs> but as we move on we have the first of the redesigns back in the show the Sons of Garmadon um I, these are some of my favorite suits because they, they, yes, they are like, they're all one color, kind of like their color. They're not a mix of black or like darker, but they're all just kind of like black or at least with this headband kind of piece and then just their color. I don't have Cole or Jay. Um, Zane, his suit is okay. Uh, I just kind of switched out his head to there, but Lloyd and yeah, these two are awesome so yeah um hunted i really i feel like these two you either love this love these suits or hate them and i absolutely adore these suits like with all the torn and tattered look with like the armor like they kind of look post-apocalyptic and i really love that i got jay cole i'm an at kai zane lloyd i think i do have all the, yeah and then neo and then Wu, which I really love. I really love how this guy came in, like one of the dragon spinner things. And I'm kind of disappointed that I didn't get all of them, which would have cost a lot of money at the time, which it still does. But these are their, by far, I think, some of their best, like $10 promo suits. So this is Legacy. Um, I mean, I, at first, I initially thought they were cool, so I got all the spinners so I could finish my collection, besides Lloyd, technically. But then I got the bounty, and these are just kind of getting repetitive now, so I guess there they are. These are my season 11. I got these from the Coles bike, and I really wish I would have gotten more. I was so close to getting, like, all of them, but I ended up folding, and I think I just didn't, I just didn't want to spend my money on those. But I regret that now, and I wanted to get the land bounty, land bounty but I just didn't, and I regret that. But I, as I said, I think these are some of my favorite. These have to be in my top five too. And I don't know what it is about them, even though they're nothing like similar to each other. I just really like how they change different, especially with the new hood and this piece, even though they're used in this. This is season 12. I really appreciate like the change up, especially with like the mask visor, this piece right over here and their hoods. And just, I really like the techno aspect of those two. I also have Lloyd, and then I have, like, the Gamer Market, and, like, their pods, which I really like, the different Kai hair, and then I pre- I mean, like, I personally, this isn't, like, my style, but I really like that torso, and, yeah, and I appreciate that we got a pink Zane during that. Another funny thing is that I have this Jay's Arcade Pod, and I just haven't opened it yet, and I don't know why, but, <laughs> yeah, when, maybe one day I'll build it. But yeah, that's part one. All right, so I did a little rearranging so that that was from the previous one and this is the new one. All right, so these are season 13, the hero ones, and they look like knights. And I don't know what it was when I first saw these or when they were in the store, but even like the sets, even though like the one that came with Jay, Lloyd, and Nia, they were just like rocks. I, I don't know what it is. Maybe it was the vibe or whatever, but I love these so much and I still can appreciate, like, I still like them. I don't just don't know what it was that compelled me to get all of them. I don't regret it, unlike 
maybe like the unlike the Ninjago movie where I may regret getting all those but these I don't regret getting because I love their clips and just the night aspect of all of them so I really love these and people don't really like the Zane because the colors don't mix but I love them Cole looks fantastic Jay's a little plain but I still appreciate it Kai love him Nia she looks amazing and then Lloyd looks different I like it and then we got a new Master Roof and I love that so then the island um Honestly, I don't know. I don't know what it was about these, but I just didn't really like them. But since I still have to get a set now from every season, I just picked up the smallest one. Even though I did see the catamaran on for twenty dollars off at Walmart like a year ago, and I kind of regret not getting that because I did kind of like the build. But these sets are okay. I mean, or like the figures are okay. The Nia actually looks. She's probably one of my favorite Nias of late. But the rest just look okay. I don't know what it is to me. Maybe it's this and how they don't have a giant hood going over it. They just so it kind of like sticks out. But I don't know what it is. But I do like their headbands. So this is Legacy season. I mean, Legacy, like second wave. You have Kai. This is a mix of rebooted and tournament. Um, I really like this one. I like Jay. They're not my favorite. They're just kind of like mid. I like Cole's orange though. And then Zane, he didn't come one, but this was like his possession. And I really love this one, and I hope they make more possession. A legacy. And then Lloyd is, okay, he came in like every set. Um, this is like the battle, I think it was called like a battle, not a battle pack, but like a battle thing. And I love these. Um, I love that, I just, I these figures are awesome. I didn't get Jay, and I don't know why. Maybe it was because the zebra, or I just don't know why. But I really like the torso for all of these and how they're different and not like nothing we've seen before. Like Kai, you haven't seen him like with a tank on, a tank top. They're just cool. And these are just like nothing we've seen before. And I like that. These are the 20th anniversary. Now, I I have I have a little, like I have a little, I'm kind of not, not mad, but I have like a little sour. There's something sour. I, I found the Colt, the one that came with Colt was Kai's like car from Rebooted. And I have the first one, and I found it for half off, so it was $25, but, so I got it, but then I didn't want it, so I returned it, but it came with the coal, and I initially wasn't going to get any of these, so I'm like, I don't even need that, but then I found this one for $20 off the set, so I got it, and then Zane's Titan Mac grew on me, so I got it, and I got this one for Christmas, so now I regret not getting that one, and I'm really mad about that. But I think I love these ones because it's like a legacy of their season. I do wish they gave him his hood, even though this might have been based off the island. I don't know. Or they should have given him a golden mask or something like that. But these are like the ninja, the ninja's allies. I guess you have Dareth, the man himself. Skylar, the elemental master. He's Ronin. I really like that figure, even though his torso is like the second torso. I like his first torso from Possession better, but... Eh, what can you do? Nelson, love that. I love that purpleness. <laughs> Pixel, we never got a new one until the recent one, as I showed earlier. Another Skylar, love that figure. And then these ones are just okay. And as I said earlier, I might, I want to get the Evo sets, but who knows. And then I didn't have this one, and I just never got around to building it. So yeah, that's my Jago collection.